Hi everyone, I'm Shao Ying Shi. Here to introduce our paper, Explainable Neural Rule Learning. Neural networks have achieved great success in recent years. However, due to the black box nature, it is a consensus that existing neural networks lack explainability, which has limited the application in domains that require transparency and accountability to make trustworthy decisions. Moreover, neural networks might exploit superior patterns as shortcuts to fit the training data instead of learning the causal patterns that consistently work on both in-distribution and out-of-distribution data. Many traditional non-neural machine learning methods are designed in an interpretable way, but their performance cannot catch up with the growing requirements of applications. Some researchers design backpropagation based techniques like layer-wise relevance propagation LRP to recover the relevance between the output and input features of a trained neural network. These post hoc techniques do not improve the intransparency nature of neural networks. And other techniques like attention network cannot completely recover how the model makes predictions. To solve the problem, in this work, we propose a novel method to conduct explainable neural rule learning, denoted as ENRL. We aim to improve neural network's explainability by instructing each module's explainable behavior and promoting the neural network to imitate a collection of rules. The overall architecture of ENRL is illustrated in the figure. Where explainable condition module, ECM, the building bricks of rules are on the left side of the figure. An ECM comprises a feature field as an argument, an operator module as a predicate, and a learnable context value as another argument. To express an atomic proposition such as x1 less than 4 or h larger than 18. In the right side of the figure, the resulting model is a multiple tree neural network where each binary tree consists of ECMs as nodes. A path from the root node to a leaf node is a rule. Finally, we design a voting mechanism for all satisfied rules so that they collaboratively determine the prediction for the input instance. We first introduce how to express rules. Let EI denotes the output of an ECI, which is between 0 to 1. It can be interpreted as the extent to how the input instance satisfies the expressed atomic proposition. Thus, the rules can be expressed by the conjunction of the outputs of the path from the root to the leaf nodes. Note that only one rule with the largest value in each tree will be activated by each input instance. The activated rules of all trees will be activated via the voting weights to output the final predictions. Explainable condition module, ECM, is designed as the building bricks for expressing rules which comprises of a feature field as an argument, an operator module as a predicate, and a learnable context value as another argument. For numeric features, we transform values into discrete buckets and ensure that larger values are discretized into buckets with larger indexes. Each position in the one-hot encoding corresponding to a feature embedding vector Operator modules are implemented by neural networks. 
the same type of operator module are shared among different ECMs. And self-supervised learning strategy is used to ensure operator modules have suitable mathematical properties. To become more flexible and possesses better expressiveness, the context values in ECMs are designed as learnable parameters. With ECM as the explainable module, rural learning can be conducted as neural architecture search, which automatically searches for suitable arrangements of feature fields and operator modules. We adopt the gumbo max trick to allow an end-to-end -end learning of these feature operator selecting weights. We utilize self-supervised operator learning tasks to grant operator modules with specific mathematical properties so that they can behave as corresponding relational operators. In this study, we implement three relational operators, including not greater than and not less than for numeric features and belong to for categorical features. Note that the operators not greater than and not less than are reflexive partial orders. A homogeneous relation is a reflexive partial order when it satisfies reflexivity and symmetry and transitivity. We can transform these mathematical properties into self sufficed loss functions. By minimizing these loss functions, we get two partial orders that work on every vector set for numeric features. The partial orders on vector space allow us to transform the numeric features into vector space while preserving their numeric properties. The context vector can be decoded via comparing the context vector with feature representation vectors. As for categorical features operator, the corresponding operator module belong to. We draw some negative samples from normal distribution during the training to simulate that a random point in the vector space is not in the set represented by the context value. Learnable parameters of an ENRL model, including embeddings for all features, multilayer perception MLP for all operator modules, architecture parameters in each ECM, and voting weights for all rules in trees. All the parameters are jointly trained end-to-end. -end. Lambda denotes the hyperparameter to control the strength of self-sufficed loss. We conduct experiments on three public real-world datasets including Adult, Credit, and Rex's Challenge 2017, and one synthetic dataset denoted as synthetic. Click-through rate prediction on code users of Rex's Challenge 2017 and test set of synthetic dataset are used to evaluate out-of-distribution performance. We compare the proposed ENRL with three widely used traditional machine learning methods and four state-of-the-art deep neural models. We conduct experiments to understand the explainability out of distribution performance and in-distribution performance of ENRL. First is the explainability. For each dataset, we show two supporting rules with the positive voting weights and one opposing rule with the negative voting weights. For adult dataset, the two supporting weights together describe that immigrants from Haiti and Honduras have high incomes if they are highly educated, while the opposing rule shows that if one's education is lower than high school, and works more than 55 hours per week, he or she is more likely to have an income of no more than 50,000. For credit dataset, it is clear that the most reliable rule 
is checking whether one experienced delinquency before and how the balance is on his credit lines. The opposing rule describes somebody that has never experienced delinquency and is in a low debt ratio. In Rex's Challenge 2017 dataset, although we cannot know the exact types of these jobs, the top rule implies that some jobs have a higher click-through rate. As for the synthetic dataset, the learned rules are more clear. The two supporting rules describe a positive cube, and the opposing rule describes a negative cube. The next is the out of distribution performance. From the table, we can observe that compared to baseline models, NRL achieves the best out of distribution performance and the significantly lower in out performance drop on both datasets. Specifically, for the synthetic dataset, Although decision tree and random forest learn explainable trees, these methods cannot learn the fundamental rules that need a combination of cultural features. On the other hand, although neural models capture higher order crossing features, they can be impacted by the superior features, which causes the in out performance drop. For Rex's challenge 2017, Traditional machine learning methods such as k nearest neighbors fail to achieve good performance on in-out distribution data due to their limited capacity. Neural models perform well on in-distribution warm users, but they suffer a significant performance drop on out-of-distribution cold users. The last is in-distribution feeding performance. In general, neural networks perform better than traditional machine learning methods due to their extraordinary expressiveness. Deep neural decision tree is designed for numeric features, which does not perform well on datasets with many categorical features, like adult and Rex's challenge 2017. DeepLight performs the best on the largest dataset Rex's challenge 2017, but does not have good performance on small datasets such as adult and credit. Since neural networks with fancy structures require plenty of data to train. In contrast, ENRL is among the top three models on all four datasets and provides comparable performance with the best one. In conclusion, in this paper, we propose a novel method named NRL to achieve explainable neural networks via learning rules with neural networks-based modules. Our main idea is twofold. One is to endow the basic neural models of NRL with explainable behaviors. Another is to orchestrate a group of these modules to imitate a collection of rules. Therefore, we design self-supervised learning tasks to regularize the behavior of these modules and apply new architecture search to learn the arrangements of these modules that can express the desired rules. Experiments on synthetic dataset and real-world dataset show that NRL exhibits competitive in-distribution performance against the baselines while providing explainability as its strength. Meanwhile, NRL significantly alleviates performance drop on out-of-distribution data. These results confirm that NRL effectively integrates neural networks' expressiveness and the rule-based system's explainability. That's all of my presentation. Thank you.